Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome back to another Ninjago 2019 March of the Oni video here on the channel. This video I find to be really interesting in terms of what I get to talk about because we get to dissect some dialogue that we heard Master Wu say in the new Season 10 Ninjago trailer where he says that this is the ninja's final stand. So, you know, that's not a direct quote. I'm just paraphrasing on that one, but it is interesting wording. Is this the final stand for the ninja? I mean, we know that Ninjago potentially will not be ending, as many things will definitely be carried over in the future, um, and Ninjago still has many years coming, according to Tommy Andreessen and a few other people that work on Ninjago and work closely with the staff. So what does Master Wu mean by final stand? Well, what I'm thinking is that he's potentially talking about the ninja's final stand to save Ninjago from these Oni creatures. Of course, we know that the Oni are possessing all of the realms, or at least taking them over in some capacity. So when you think about it, this is probably the biggest threat that we've ever seen the ninja face. I mean, yeah, the Overlord was a big threat, and yeah, other things have happened, you know, cross realms. But this is probably one of the biggest conflicts that we're ever going to see the ninja face. Um, and that's all coming from the fact that Master Wu, you know, is declaring this to be one of the biggest threats. And if we know anything about Master Wu, is that he is extremely spiritual and he knows much about Ninjago and he knows when things are, uh, you know, about to get serious. And if he's saying that this is potentially the final stand, I think we should be re uh, relatively worried for our favorite ninja. Of course, as the Oni are going to be such huge threats, what exactly will the ninja be doing to try to stop them? They've taken over multiple realms at this point, and there's really no way to guarantee that the ninja will come out on top this go-around. I mean, they probably will, but when you think about it, a four-episode TV movie probably could bring some sort of interesting flair to the Ninjago TV series, especially considering it is a TV movie. It would make sense that there would be a big event happening like a new Ninjago movie, for a big event and a big conclusion, such as the ninja hopping in between realms to try to defeat the Oni, and, you know, that constant back and forth between Lloyd and Garmadon is continuing as well, and will eventually, presumably, be resolved this season as well. It's interesting to think about, and I'm, I don't know if I should be worried or if I should be excited, because the ninja's last stand could be one of the best things that we've ever seen in, in, in Ninjago, um, but when you think about it, it's quite worrying, because what will the actual damage toll be after this is all over? The Oni are extremely powerful beings, and what exactly will they leave when they're presumably defeated? Or if they actually win and take over all of the realms, what will Ninjago look like moving forward? Of course, you know, thinking about that, it would be pretty much a direct ripoff of Season Nine story, where the villains have completely taken over, but it could be very severe and would definitely be more extreme than what the Sons of Garmadon did throughout Season Nine. The Oni would absolutely destroy the entirety of the 16 realms and will destroy the balance in general. So I really don't see how the ninja can come out on top on this one. And I guess I, you know, I'm probably really worried because of Master Wu's wording in that most recent trailer. Of course, let me know what you think about all this down below in the comment section. What will the ninja's last stand look like when it actually plays out in season 10? And what do you think the outcome of the Oni and ninja will actually be? Feel free to leave a comment down below discussing all of that. But of course, guys, with that being said, that'll just about do it for this video here. If you enjoyed the video, as always, be sure to give it a huge thumbs up rating. And of course, remember to hit the subscribe button if you have not done so already. Once again, guys, the comment section is there for the various discussions that you would like to have regarding this topic. Or if you just had a comment of a general nature, that's fine as well. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Once again, my name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you farewell.